Hello and welcome to this summary episode of Forward Slash Reality. I'm back with Ash Paxad. Hey guys, me again. So, today we have an episode on Mentos and Coke. We are not the first and we're not going to be the last. Let's do it. Okay, so we just came back from a Coke and Mentos experiment. I got hit in the face. So there are two parts to the uh, Coke and Mentos eruption. There's first, there's the chemical reaction that occurs between all the fake sugars and other chemicals in the Diet Coke, which is why it must be a Diet Coke and not a regular Coke, because natural sugars don't form the same reactions. And the second part is the uh, shape of the Mentos itself. Because the Mentos is a very bubbly, unsmooth, very rough surface, this gives you a lot of surface area. And if you remember back to the, uh, the previous videos I've done, you'll know that surface area, the bigger it is, the more violent the reaction is. Also, along with the increased surface area, increasing the rate of reaction, it also allows for increased nucleation sites, which is a related phenomenon. And a nucleation site is, well, it's essentially where a bubble can form. And you can see, so if you pour a fizzy drink into a glass, any tiny scratches or particles of dust on the side of the glass act as nucleation points, and that's where the bubbles form from. Now, imagine that if you're producing a lot of gas, you have the potential for a lot of bubbles, and you're just giving it handfuls of bubble-producing space. You can see what's going to happen. So if we combine these two things together, then we've got a reaction occurring and we're making it occur very vigorously by adding lots of surface area to it. And the reason why we end up with such a geyser and such a fountain of spewing coke and menthol juice everywhere, the reaction produces a lot of gases and because it's dispersed throughout the water, the gases in the water mix into a foam. And because there's a whole lot of gases produced out of a little bit of liquid and solid, this creates a massive increase in pressure and if you have an increase in pressure in a small place, generally try to escape through the easiest possible way, going bang. Give me the face. <laughs> yeah. Don't don't hold your eye over it. La la la, test, test, test. La la la, test, test, test. La la la. Test, test, test. 